Okay, Larry Biel again, and uh, this will be the final segment on the uh, stators, your alternators. Uh, today we'll talk about the 15 amp uh, dual wire stator. This uh, this actually uses a regulator. Um, what you'll find is on the 15 amp stator, if you notice, there is a lot more uh, copper windings. Uh, as the and magnets spin, this will generate much more current than uh, than the 9 amp stators, and then uh, it is also uh, set up to where the winding is not grounded, so you have two wires coming out uh, of this particular stator, and it would plug into uh, a regulator. So, looking at a diagram on how this would work is you have your your stator winding and your connector going into a regulator so we show two AC inputs going into a regulator then the regulator is grounded then you have your positive output uh, the regulator for the most part uh, contains diodes uh, those diodes may or may not but for this particular example uh, for, for my regulator I will use a bridge rectifier setup also because um, it's a higher current your regulator is usually heat synced meaning that it would have some type of aluminum fins to dissipate the heat so what we have here is uh, we have the white wires connecting to the input so that would be coming from the stator, okay, and then we have the negative and positive DC outputs. Again, the diode assembly, as the AC signal comes in, it only allows the positive side to go this direction and it allows the negative side to go this direction. The bridge rectifier setup with a heat sink provides uh, the most amperage that, the, that you can get off of this type of setup. So I'll go ahead and turn on the transformer. We come over here, turn on the multimeter, and as you notice, we have our uh, charging voltage. If you notice from the previous state, uh, 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 segments that this one is a much higher uh, voltage, and that also allows us to pull current such as the light and still maintain a high charging current. So this is uh, pretty much how your uh, 15 amp stator with a regulator would be set up. And this will end my segment uh, for the charging systems and we will now uh, transition over into the starter and we'll look at uh, how the starter functions. Thank you.